everybody, I'm Lisa. Behind the camera is Bill. Together we are Bill Lisa. Welcome to our channel and welcome to our home. So today is a rainy day. We're just kind of hanging out, but at the beginning of the week, it was 80 degrees here. And I started getting all these emails with all of these bathing suits that are being released and all these sales they're having. So I decided it's time to start ordering bathing suits. I am going to do a Disney bathing suit haul and try on. These bathing suits are all from Hot Topic. I got an email, I saw these cool suits, and I decided I'm gonna try out their Disney suits and see what they're like because that is what I felt like doing. So let's get started. Here is the one piece. So I did order a one piece just because they looked really cute online and I really liked the Mickey Mouse style of this. However, I had to pick one size, obviously, it's one piece, so I got an extra small. This extra small is too big for my booty and too small for my top half. So it's cute and it did have really good potential, but it just doesn't quite fit me right. But if this is something you're looking for, I think you should check it out. So right now, this bathing suit is $50 regular price, but they're having an online sign sale for 20% off anything you buy online. Also, just so you know, if you sign up to receive emails from Hot Topic, you get an additional 30% off your entire purchase. And if you spend over $60 right now, you get free shipping. So that is one of the reasons I chose to order these. So like I said, this one's really, really cute. It just doesn't fit me right. So let's move on to the next one. This two-piece bathing suit, I really like. It is Jack Skellington. One of the reasons I purchased it is because I knew I had this baseball hat. And sometimes when I'm out by the pool, I want a hat to keep the sun off my face. And I knew this would be a perfect pool ensemble. For this bathing suit, I purchased extra small bottoms and a small top. So that worked much better for me as far as sizing is concerned. These bottoms do fit really, really nicely. And look how cute, the little details are really, really great. I wasn't sure how I would feel about this little like skirty thing on it, but it's not too excessive and I actually kind of like it. But the little bows on the side and this really, really cute design on the front is perfect. I will tell you with these bathing suits, the last one I tried on and this one as well, the tops are really, really padded. So take that into consideration when you are choosing the size for yourself. I'm very happy with this. I do also like for the top, it's completely adjustable because this is a tie and this is a tie. Sometimes when you order a bathing suit top, it has a hook and you don't have any sizing preferences or choices. And sometimes if I order a little bit bigger size in order to fit my chest size, it doesn't fit me right, right around here and it lays funny. So this is a double thumbs up having two ways to adjust the size right here, halfway down and up around the neck. I also like a halter neck on a bathing suit. It fits comfortably and it feels secure and I don't have any concern if I'm diving into a pool that the sleeves are gonna, or the straps are gonna slip off. This bathing suit is a thumbs up. I'm really happy with it and happy with the fit. So I definitely think I'm going to keep this one. If Queen Elsa were to buy a bathing suit, this is definitely the one she would pick. Same sizing, I got a small top, extra small bottoms, but these bottoms don't fit quite as well. They are a little big and they're a little bit baggy. There are places that you can, of course, take bathing suits to get them altered. If I choose to keep this one, I'll probably take the bottoms to a place called Fresh Peaches. They're very reasonable in their pricing. They're in Rancho Cucamonga and they do alter and they make these fit really, really nice. I have taken bathing suits there in the past, but I love the snowflake right here going with the Frozen theme, especially because the movie Frozen 2 just came out recently in theaters and it's on DVD now. It is a perfect bathing suit for the summer. I really like the shimmer to it. The fabric is really, really nice and shimmery and super smooth and soft. So I know especially when this bathing suit gets wet, it's gonna be sparkling and really beautiful. And of course, 
you have to have a little winter during your summer, especially since today is a rainy day. This is actually probably the perfect bathing suit for today. The other reason I picked this one is because I have my Arendelle Blue Frozen 2 ears that I love to wear to Disneyland and now I can wear them out by the pool while I'm wearing my Elsa bathing suit. This is the first bikini the cameraman approves of. This was actually my very favorite one on the website, which is why I waited to show this one to you last. And this is the first time I've tried any of these on. So I didn't know how these were going to fit until I tried them on to show you because I wanted to experience it together. But this is definitely my favorite one. I love the Minnie Mouse theme. It's so cute. It has Minnie Mouse ears right here and a really cute little red bow. It also says Minnie Mouse across the front and I love the little ruffled skirt. It does fit really nice. Of course, the polka dots are great, but the other thing that's really cute, if you look closely, is not only are they just polka dots, but they are mini mouse heads as well, which makes it double cute. I have this really great hat. Unfortunately, the ears get a little wonky sometimes, but when they stand up straight, it's so cute and I can definitely see myself hanging out at the Disneyland Hotel wearing this. This is my favorite and I'm so glad I bought it. And again, this is the, the bottoms again on this are extra small and the top is a small. That is the really great thing about getting a two piece is you can get different sizes for bottoms and tops, which is helpful because some people are different sizes in those areas, but I really like the fit. I also like, again, that this is another bathing suit that you can adjust at both areas, the neck and the back to make it fit just perfectly. I do think I'm gonna be keeping this one. I really, really love it. And as you heard, the cameraman approves of this one as well. <laughs> he gives it a thumbs up. And I need him to like it because he's the one that has to take me to the Disneyland Hotel. And maybe I can get into if I'm gonna wear this cute little bathing suit for him. Next up is the Mickey Mouse Rash Guard. I really, really love this. It's made of a swimsuit material. It fits perfectly, it's really comfortable, and it stretches and moves nicely with you. I just have on some little black shorts with it, and I really think I will enjoy wearing this, especially if it's a day that we've been at Disneyland and out in the sun all day, but we wanna hang out by the pool. I can put on a hat, and I can put this on to protect myself from the sun, but still be cute and comfortable. And of course, I can wear this in the pool to go swimming. I think this was a really good choice and I'm definitely planning on keeping this because I think it will have a lot of uses for me. The back is just plain, but with the sleeves, it's awesome. The sleeves have really cute little Mickey Mouse and this is actually supposed to be a Lilo and Stitch theme was what they named it when I was buying it with the little Hawaiian hibiscus and he's playing a cute little ukulele. I love this Mickey with a lay on and his sunglasses. I'm going to really enjoy hanging out by the pool with my sunglasses on as well to match Mickey. I know which bathing suits I like the best, but I want to know what you think. I want to know which bathing suit is your favorite. So comment down below and let me know so that I can take that into consideration when I'm choosing which ones to keep. This Mickey Mouse themed one piece bathing suit is really, really cute and stylish. I love the polka dots here and I love the yellow bow. But take into consideration if you do decide to buy this one that the top has a lot of really, really thick padding. It doesn't just have an underwire for shape, it's really padded. So remember that and pick your size accordingly. The one piece bathing suits run around $50 a piece before any discounts are taken into consideration. Let's move on to the two piece bathing suit. This of course was my favorite when I was trying it on, the Minnie Mouse. I love this one the best. And while this one has a nice underwire and it does have some shape to it, it doesn't have nearly as much padding. It's a little bit more natural. So I was very, very happy with that in this particular bathing suit. 
The two-piece bathing suits run around $27 for the top and $27 for the bottom. And that is before any kind of discounts are taken into consideration. So for the set, they run around $54 a piece. It's the same for all of the tops and bottoms that I purchased in this um, video that I have shown you. The next one up was the Jack Skellington. I love Jack Skellington and I love that theme. So I'm really, really considering this bathing suit as well because it's so, so cute. With the ruffles and the design, I really, really think I'll get a lot of attention wearing this bathing suit. Same as the Minnie Mouse top, it has a nice underwire and a little bit of shaping, not too much padding, but it does have a little more padding than the Minnie Mouse top. The Queen Elsa bathing suit, I certainly wish the bottoms would have fit me a little bit better because I love the sparkly material. This one, however, does have a little more padding in the top, a little more similar to the one piece Mickey Mouse bathing suit, but it also has a nice underwire to keep things in place. So that's one of the things that I do like about their bathing suits. The rash guard, super cute. I'm really glad that I gave this one a chance. I almost didn't, but I'm glad I did because I think I'm really gonna enjoy wearing this. And I think that it's really going to get a lot of attention as well. I think it's also gonna be really versatile. So again, comment down below and let me know which ones you liked the best and which ones you think I should keep. Thank you so much for watching my video. I hope this encourages you to get out there and buy some bathing suits because the hot weather is gonna be here before you know it and you're gonna need something new and cute to wear out by the pool. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.